Hello chess lovers, I have a very short game for you played by Alexander Kotov and Tigran Petrosyan. The game was played in 1949. Let's see how the game went on. Kotov started with d4, d5 by Petrosyan, c4, e6, we see queen's gambit declined, knight c3, knight f6, c takes d5, this is the exchange variation of queen's gambit, e takes d5, bishop g5, bishop e7, e3, c6, queen c2, and in this position black is mainly playing knight d7 or castling king side. But in this position, Petrosian made a very horrible mistake by playing knight e4, which allows white to go for a very simple tactics. Can you find the next winning sequence of moves? Ready? Well, white simply took on e7, queen takes e7. If you take on e7 with a king, you are losing your right to castle. White can simply take on e4, and this is again winning for white. That's why black took on e7 with a queen, and now comes a very simple tactics. Knight takes d5, eyeing on c8 bishop. Black took on d5, and simply queen takes c8 check. Queen d8, bishop b5 check, knight c6, bishop takes c6, Pawn takes c6, queen takes c6 check, and in this position Petrosian resigned. Black is two pawns down, and black also has to move his king. This is just a losing position for black, that's why as I have already mentioned, black resigned. Your comments and questions please, and thanks for watching. Good luck.